the world of joyful learning. Namaste everyone. My dear children, very good morning. Hope everyone is doing good. Welcome to today's English class. Before starting today's class, first let's sanitize our hands. Now we are done. Our hands are all clean. Nice. So dear children, this is our rhymes time. Everyone knows Mary had a little lamb. Yes. So today we will sing Mary had a little lamb. So let's start. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, it was for spot and snow. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, it was for spot and snow. Everywhere Mary went, Mary went, Mary went. Everywhere Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, it was for white and snow. Everywhere Mary went, Mary went, Mary went. Everywhere Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white and snow. Follow her to school one day, school one day, school one day. Follow her to school one day, which was again that goal. Follow her to school one day, school one day, school one day. Follow her to school one day, which was again the goal. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white and snow. Mary the children laugh and play, laugh and play, laugh and play. Mary the children laugh and play to see the lamb at school. Mary the children laugh and play. Laugh and play, laugh and play, to see the lamb at school. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white and snow. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white and snow. I hope you enjoy with this rhymes. Dear children, we learned in previous class capital letters A to Z. Okay, but today we are going to learn small letter how to write. So, everybody, you have to keep four lines copy at your home. Yes. So, how you will write? You get the board. First, F for apple. How you will write a apple? Small c, then curl. Small c, then curl. You have to write a for apple in between two lines. In between two lines. Okay? Then b for ball. Standing line. Then curve. Standing line, then curve. You have to use three lines for right before ball. Okay, next letter is C for cat. Curve in the middle of two lines. Curve in the middle of two lines. Okay, then D for dog, then D for dog, map standing line, then curve, standing line, then curve, you have to use only three lines, 
Okay. Epo elephant. How you will write Epo elephant? Okay. Look at the board. A small cup in the middle of two lines. Then small cup. Okay. How you will write Epo fish? Look at the board. A standing line. Then half cup, then sleeping line. Map apple fish. You have to use only three lines. How you write zippo gaps? Firstly, map a small zippo gap. Then standing line. That's the last line. Then small cup. Okay. The next letter as for hand. You have to use three lines, then half cup. Okay. I for ice cream. Small standing line, then dot. Then J for J. Map standing line in the bottom of three lines. Map standing line in the bottom of three lines and a dot. Okay, everybody. So look at the board. F for apple. B for ball. C for cat, T for dog, E for elephant, F for fish, G for grapes, H for hen, I for ice cream, J for jug. Now kids, I hope you have to practice how to write all the alphabets at your home. Thank you. Have a good day.